Hello everyone, this is Mike. Today's video is going to show you a little hack that I think some of you will really appreciate, especially those who are in our reseller program and very especially for those who are interested in the upcoming release of Reseller Pro. So let's jump right in and see what I mean. So I'm here in Platform Branding, which you can reach by going to the Flyout menu and selecting Platform Branding. And here, if you scroll down, you will see that you can completely control the platform colors using a variety of settings here. Now, recently you may have noticed the appearance of these copy icons. And when you copy them, it's not immediately obvious what this is for. So what you're copying to your clipboard here is what is known as a CSS variable that's tied directly to the value that is in this particular color picker. And the same goes for all these other color pickers. When I copy this one, for example, it will copy a variable that will be directly tied to this color value, whatever it may be. So why is this useful? Well, let's look. So here I am on a dashboard template, and you'll see why we're working in templates here in just a sec. And you'll notice that if I preview this dashboard, that the colors are pretty much synonymous with the colors that I have in my platform here. Now look what might happen if I change my primary color here to, let's just go with a red. Let's go with a nicer red that might be more applicable. Here we go. It's still pretty bright, but we'll click save here. And then we'll go back to where that dashboard is. Okay, here we are. And I'm gonna refresh now, and then I'm going to See, now my colors match what we set in platform branding. And then I'm going to preview this. And look what happens. This dashboard now matches my platform. So how is this useful, especially in a template type situation? So everyone has the ability to contribute templates to the template library. And this is the one we're looking at here. Chameleon just means that it's set up with the CSS variables. You can contribute the template. I've already contributed this one, so I can update the contribution. And this is the form, and then you submit for approval. And if everything is above board, you can get an approval within a few days. And then that template will be available in the template library. Now let's imagine the person who downloaded your template out of the template library has their colors set as such. And you'll see that when I save, if I scroll down, the primary color has changed now. So when they download that template for use in their account, it will have the colors already applied automatically. So as a reseller, imagine that you have reseller templates, or if you are a Sweet Dash coach or your business coach, and you are distributing templates to your students or to your customers or your clients, if they're set up in this way, when they arrive in that target account, they'll already be color correct for that account based on the settings that are set in platform branding. And this will seem pretty magical to the people who receive it because they don't even have to do anything to make the colors match. It just works right out of the box. Now, how is this achieved? Well, this takes a little bit of CSS knowledge, but not too much. You can basically use custom CSS, and then wherever you might put in a color using a hex code or RGB, you just drop in that thing that was copied to your clipboard, which consists of this value, for example, tied to the top bar color. Then there are other values for text, say the top bar text color. And these are just copied directly from platform branding using the copy icon that was showed initially. So again, if you are one of our official resellers and you're using reseller profiles to transfer templates down to your child accounts, you can just modify your templates to work as custom CSS like this with these CSS variables. The CSS is attached to the template, so when it's extracted in the other account, it will include the custom CSS and it will work right out of the box. For those of you who plan on taking advantage of the Reseller Pro program, when you sell an account from your website seamlessly without any interaction from you, it will be delivered with the templates that you designate via the reseller profiles. You will be able to set the platform colors in advance using what we call branding templates. Then all of the dashboard templates, portal page templates, landing page templates, etc., that you design using this method would automatically follow the colors as they were set in platform branding via the branding template. But what's cool in that scenario is that your customers who purchased the software from you decide to white label, they would be able to do that. 
they would be able to change those initial platform branding colors to match their brand, their colors, and all the templates that you provided for them will automatically change without them having to do anything. So they're even more useful to that target reseller child account because now the value that you bring in designing dashboards and templates and things of that nature can be amplified because it will automatically follow the color choices that they make in platform branding. Okay, I know this one was a little more complex than normal. This feature is designed for advanced users. So if all of that went over your head, don't worry about it. But just know that the power is there if you ever step to that place. For those of you who understand everything that I just said, I think you'll be geeking out on this a little bit. So have fun with it. Make sure that you know about our reseller program and more specifically about the upcoming Reseller Pro release. Thanks everyone out there. We'll see you in the next one. Have a great day.